Hey YouTube, welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Melanie Janine. For those who don't know me, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Because now that you're here, it's not going back. Like, respectfully. Like, are you dumb, stupid, or retarded? Like, welcome to death row. But anyways, as you can tell by the title, I'll be doing a Q&A today. It's a long overdue video, I'm not gonna lie. Like... I've been posted about doing questions and I just never done it. I don't know why, but I'm here today. And I know it's been a while since I made a video. Like it's really been over a month, which is crazy to me. And I do apologize, you know, life has just been lifing. Like, this is me, this is life. Straight like that. But it's okay, cause we're back and we're better and I'm gonna have more content for you starting 2023 because that's gonna be our time of greatness respectfully and if you hear some squeaking noises in the back that's my dog playing with his toys oh and now he's gotten closer so please disregard that if you do hear that we're living in his world i guess but i'm gonna stop with the chit chatting and i'ma just get right into the questions so a while back i had asked my um instagram to give me questions to answer for youtube so i'ma take these questions that i've had in my notes for the longest and i'ma just answer them now so stay tuned all right so number one is who or what motivates you um i say who would say my family as in my parents like they really motivate me I feel like they're always trying to push me to be a better me so yeah and it's like looking up to them like they've done a lot for me and my sisters so I feel like that is my motivation what as for what motivates me I say me just trying to improve myself as a person like trying to improve myself emotionally mentally physically financially all that so i feel like my past is what motivates me you feel me dog all right number two what made you want to start a youtube channel Whew. so i've always wanted to be a youtuber like ever since i was younger like if you know you know i have a video on youtube of me from when i was like eight or nine years old hello and it's everyone my name is melanie i am Dominican and this is called the Dominican show I just always wanted to be a youtuber I feel like YouTube is always fun also I'm a shy person so I feel like me talking on YouTube it's a way for me to get out there put myself out there like I just enjoy doing YouTube I enjoy editing editing as stressful as it may sound it's so much fun to do like I just love it I love it so much and I feel like I would want to be able to share my life with y'all like it's just so much fun something I'm interested in I also want to like meet new people and I feel like this is a great way to express yourself meet new people from around the world so yeah number three biggest pet peeve so I'm not gonna lie I have a lot of pet peeves and I when I say a lot I mean a lot <sighs> let's see Damn, I really gotta think. Biggest pet peeve. I have a whole bunch that is so crazy that I can't even think of one right now. Like, it's so much that bothers me. I guess one would be loudness. Like, don't get me wrong, I could be a little loud sometimes too. But when other people are, like, being loud and just doing too much, that's irks my soul like why are you so ratchet that's what it is being mad ratchet and ghetto for no reason it could be freaking eight of eight i can't even speak it could be eight o'clock in the morning and it's just the ratchetness and the loudness will really get to me like oh i hate that so much like y'all don't even understand and i could go on and on with this list of biggest pet peeves but i'm gonna just keep it short and simple loudness ratchetness the ghettoness especially in the morning uh-uh don't don't no 
Next question. What's your favorite food? Man, I'm not even gonna lie. I, I like a lot of food. I'm not a picky eater. Like, I could literally eat whatever. But I'll say my top one is sushi. Like, I love sushi. Like, I would never get tired of sushi. It's so good. But I really only eat cooked sushi. I don't really like raw sushi like that. And it's not my type of thing. But cooked sushi, God bless. Like, that's the best thing ever created. Like... I love it so much. I just finished eating some sushi too. Like, that shit bust. <laughs> that shit bust for real. All right, next question. Um, What's your favorite thing to do? Make money, respectfully. I'm a hustler. I like to work for things so I could get whatever I want. Okay? Because if you're not getting money, what you doing with your life? Okay. All right, but besides that, I think everybody likes getting money. But I like I like going out. I like trying new places, going on adventures with friends. I really love late night drives. And it's funny because I don't like driving. I hate driving. And I hate driving because I'm literally the only driver in my friend group. So it's like, I'm always driving. I'm always driving. Like, nobody's ever driving me around. But besides that, like, I really love late night drives, like, with no destination. I like doing that a lot. Um, getting eats late night. And it don't have to be, like, actual eats. It could just be, like, chocolate covered strawberries. If you know the spot, you know. Like, them shits bust late at night specifically, too. Like, I just love doing it. Another thing I like to do, YouTube. I love making videos. I love editing. Like, I already told y'all. It's so much fun. It's stressful and annoying, but it's so much fun. Like, trust me on that. All right, next question. Um, do you enjoy shopping at the mall or online? <sighs> online, strictly online. I don't like going to the mall because I feel like there's nothing in the mall. You won't find anything you like at the mall at all. Like, I will really only go to the mall if I need something very last minute. Like, let's say I'm going to, event, to an event the day of and I need something, I'll just go real quick. But I hate shopping in the mall. Like, there's never anything. And if you do find something you like, it's either not your size or something is wrong with it. So that's why online is the best. Like, even when I do go to the mall, I hate trying stuff on. Like, I don't feel, like, I'm so lazy. No. So that's why I like shopping online. If something doesn't fit me from online, I'm going to just take the L, respectfully. I don't even do online returns because that's mad work. Yeah, online all the time. And half the time, well, most of the time, when I do order online, everything I get be fitting me. Like, it's, I feel like I know my body. I know what I'm buying. I know what I'm wearing. So every time I order online, like, it's always a W. But yeah, don't like them all. I'll go here and there, but don't like it. Next question. Read the fifth to last message between you and your ex. Or ex. I don't have an ex. If you know me. You know, I've never been in a relationship, so I don't have an ex. And vibes are not exes. They're vibes. Old vibes, not ex. So yeah, we're leaving it at that. Favorite hobby? Hmm. I feel like I'm such a boring person because I don't really have a hobby like that. But I was so into doing makeup and eyelashes. But I figured out that lashes is not for me. But makeup, like I really like doing my own makeup when I'm going out. I don't do it every day on a daily basis or I don't do it like when I'm bored. I just do it when I go out. I feel like it's fun sometimes. Like just, you know, going from this to a better version period so yeah i'll say makeup <laughs> makeup is a favorite hobby i guess favorite person um i don't think i have a favorite person i'm not gonna lie i feel like i love everybody equally yeah i don't i don't favoritism i don't do the favoritism shit like Cause if you play that with me, it's quiet. You could the dough. The dough. Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. Get out of here, man. 
so yeah i don't have a favorite person i love everybody equally um go to phrase i have a lot but i be saying are you dumb stupid or retarded i'm always saying that phrase and i don't know where i got it from but I'm always saying that. I'm always saying that in my videos too. Because are you dumb, stupid, or retarded? I feel like everybody just be moving so stupid that I need to use that phrase. I also be saying DTM for life to the day I die and to the grave. Always say that. That's my motto. If you don't like it, that's too bad. But yeah, those are my top two go-to phrases. Because are you dumb, stupid, or retarded? Uh, my camera's about to die. Let me make this quick. Next question. Um, how do you feel life is going for you right now? <sighs> when I tell you life has been lifing, I mean life has been lifing and not even in a good way. Like, it's not even a bad way either, but I just feel like I've been stuck in life. Like, I feel like I don't know what's going on for me in life. I'm tired of doing the same thing. It's always repetitive. Um, if you know, I'm not in school right now and I work two jobs. So I feel like it's just boring doing the same thing over and over again. Like nothing exciting is happening in my life. And yeah, like life is really life -ing. Like I feel like this is, this is me becoming an adult. I was a child, a teenager for so long, and I'm finally an adult, and I'm finally experiencing what life really is. Like, this shit is stressful, man. But, it's nothing you could do about it but just go with the flow. But yeah, I'm hoping 2023 will be a better year for me. Um, new things to come, you know? Like, I just need some type of excitement. Like, I feel not dead, but I feel like I'm just here, I'm just here, just another soul on this world. My camera really interrupted me and stopped recording. But the question was, what do you want to be remembered for? So I feel like I wanted to, be, I want to be remembered for being this strong, independent woman, you know, hustler. Um that person that anybody could go to with situation problems whatever it is just you know outgoing i don't know if i said that but yeah an outgoing person somebody that was fun you know i just want to be remembered for being fun being the life of the party and not really parties like literally but i'm saying you know always the excitement in people's lives um this is actually the last question. What would most people be surprised to learn about you? Um, people would be surprised to learn about me. What would people be surprised to learn about me? I don't know. I feel like I could be a, full of a lot of surprises. I'm not going to lie. But you know, because people be having so much misconceptions about me thinking i'm bougie this that and third but no i'm not at all like i'm really laid back i'm chill i'm calm i do what i gotta do like that's really about it i'm not gonna lie so yeah i don't know if that's surprising but i don't know a lot of people say i'm bougie and i look like i'm so conceited this that and the third but i'm really not like i'm really a calm cool chill ass person like Y'all just gotta, you know, get to know me. Period. Straight like that. But yeah, that's the ending of the questions. I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Because I'm... If y'all don't, I'm about to... Yeah. Don't touch me. Don't play with me. Nah, I'm playing. I will not do that. I love all of y'all. But... Yeah, for real though, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for videos. I have a trip coming up, which I'm going to vlog for y'all because I feel like y'all deserve that. Y'all need to come along with me. But, um, yeah, give me some more video suggestions y'all want to see on my channel. Um, and yeah, that's it for the video. Christian Dior, Dior. <laughs> Melly out.